One, two, check. Hilarious.
Testing one, two, three. Do you, testing? One, two, three? Hello. Are you testing? Testing. What are you testing? I'm testing three, four, five. But I'm only testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Testing three, four, five. I learned in broadcasting school you're supposed to, when on camera, scratch your eyeball a lot. Like this. Is that why you do that? I scratch my eyeball all the time. It's from broadcasting school, huh? Mmm. Show me something. What's me? A Mario. No? What is it? Empire. It's me. Oh, I love it. Mario! Oh! <laughs> Can't do impressions when you got someone else's hair on your face. Funny. Take that how I meant it. We got a lot of stuff tonight. Articles I can't find. Mad Lib. I have, uh, oh, the, I gotta preload the tip. You people are just gonna have to wait. We're on it. Yeah, we're on it. We got the challenge. Yeah. We got uh, the thing I'm gonna work on in Minecraft. Yeah. I think we're only missing just snacks. Oh, shit. oh cancel the show. Crap. We got the cool, cool, cool music, surfing da, da, music. Da, 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 da. The vasty waves, Nappy says. The vasty <laughs> waves. Oh man. Um, I've got my. Thank you. Oh, Nappy. I can go to college. Just subscribe with Twitch Prime. Thanks, Nappy. Weird. Isn't he a dreamboat? He is a dreamboat. <laughs> I got Mama hooked up tonight to the tablet, so Mama can hear all of her audio cues. I can hear Including... It. Beds, dynamites, beds! This is the first time I heard, isn't he a dreamboat? So we've got the audio cues hooked up. If this is comfortable and okay for Mama, if she even wants to hear the cues, maybe we'll keep the cues going. But Fun. I thought it was neat for her to hear the cues, but I, th I, th I thought. Let me just chop date the thing down here, the thing that I want to update. Oh, creepy music. Creepy music. I don't hear any creepy music. Am I supposed to hear creepy music? Yes. I don't hear any music. Oh, no, I just heard creepy music. Oh, okay. And then what's the date? Oh, yeah, dating. Dating tip. That's the one I've got tonight. The Vasty Wives. <laughs> Your dating tip of the day. Um, trying to organize these chests you have in here. It's just a mess. It is, it is nuts. It's nuts. Well, hello, everybody. Perfect. Let's see. Perfect. How you doing, Nappy? All right, we've got that. And the marriage thing, I just, I guess I can't find it. I thought I had it today. Yeah, you did. I you did. said you had something. I had it. It's gone. Doing Jackson. Doing on Jackson. Oh, doing okay. Well, okay then. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. We got the baby sleeping. Um, yeah. Yes, everyone seems to be uh, quiet. Else quiet, which is good. Hooray! Yay, search. I feel like I want to keep the music going. <laughs> you do seem to be enjoying it. <laughs> it's good. It's surf music. It's like. I'm in Pulp Fiction. But who am I in that movie? Who am I? Hmm. Ah. Here's the question. Here's the question. Hey, I can hear you on my screen. You can hear who? Oh, uh, let's see. I can hear you. You can hear me on you can your hear, screen. Well, because you're opening stuff around me. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha. Lots of microphones. Gotcha. Gotcha, Jackson. Gotcha. I had I had the topic I had it. Multi. Do we believe him? 
No, we don't. <laughs> Well, I hope everybody's well. Thanks, everybody, for coming out to the chat tonight. We're going to start up here in a moment. Uh, we've got our Mad Lib. We have our um, sort of all of our topics. Not really. We had I had one, and I can't seem to find it. It's okay. Oh, but I don't have a marriage tip. It was going to help the guys out there. It was a guy's marriage tip. I'll, I'll make it up. I remember reading some of it. I, I, I perused the... Uh, I peru remember where it was from? I do. I'm on the site, and I can't find it. You can't find it. Now. That's okay. Oh, anyway. Thanks for coming to the channel. Thank you again. Four months already, Nappy says. Four months we've been doing this. Happy, really? Well, four months since we've been affiliate. Yikes. Yeah. Super crazy. So we appreciate you all coming out to the chat tonight. Hang out with us. Uh, this is Couples Therapy. We'll do the introduction in a moment, but we always do a dating tip, a marriage tip. Uh, we're going to do a Mad Lib. I'm not going to tell you the title, but we are... Let's see if I can do this. I don't. Upside down. Uh, you like some of those words? Upside down. You can't even see it. so strange. But we're gonna... <laughs> yeah, I am. Well, yeah, well, oh, yeah, yeah. There we go. So uh, we need some... What is it? Verb ending in ing, adjective, adjective, plural noun, adjective, person in a room. Person in room. Oh, okay. Plural noun, a place, adjective. Celebrity, noun, plural noun, adjective, plural noun. Should I fill in celebrity right now with share? Yeah, I think you have to. I think I have to. Sorry, folks. Celebrity is taken. Share is my, my go-to. If you're watching, share. Love you. <laughs> in a I've never appreciated your music type of way. Love you. Possibly. Noun, plural noun, adjective, plural noun, plural noun, noun, plural noun. Keep it clean, family friendly. Love to do this. Start throwing in the chat. If I miss them, you got to remind me, but we'll try to fill that in a little bit here, too. Let me get in the game. Get in the game. <laughs> yeah, Nappy does. Do you believe in life after love? All right, look at all these flowers. Why do I have all these flowers? Oh, yeah. Remember? No. Oh, we did our flower game. You do you won. want uh, Do you want this? Where did you put your yes, flowers? Yes, I want them. Oh, please don't get rid where of them. You, um, where did you I put them? I have them all in my inventory. You want to throw them at me? <laughs> I'm showering you with flowers. Shower me with flowers. Shower, Shower me with you roses. with flowers. Oh. Forgot why Thank they you. were Thank you. in my Thank inventory. Thank you. Thank you. Have some apples and seeds <coughs> while oh, no. you're at it. What happened to my thing? There you go. So I know what I'm working on today. So uh, let's do the beginning here. Ooh, Welcome I hear back the music. to couples therapy. Most of the kids are sleeping, <laughs> and you and your friends and loved ones and your cats and dogs have joined us tonight for another wonderful episode. So. Pull up a couch, fix your dating and marriage life, and hang out with Jackson out of my mind. Terms and conditions apply. See you for details. Welcome. That's the beginning of our show. That's what we say every time. One, two, three. I have teleported. What was that? I teleported. That's my teleportation sound. Oh, man. Interesting. And the game is like. You shouldn't freak us out like that. The game's all freaked out. It's all freaked out. Well, also, what we do at the beginning of the show is um, if you're new to Twitch, if you're growing your Twitch channel, you might want to consider having a Twitch community that you're a part of. I'm part of the BS07. I'm also part of Club Nub. Uh, you might notice some people on the channel here, if they put an 07 or club <sighs> in the chat, then they are also part of those groups. So I encourage you that if you don't have a Twitch uh, community that you're a part of, find one. We kind of try to get into each other's streams, get into each other's heads. Getting weird. Oh. Get into each other's heads. Uh, follow each other on Twitter, on all the social channels. If you see them streaming, jump in, chat for five to ten minutes. If you start really liking some of the people that you're hanging out with, spend more time with them, collaborate with them, and you can all help each other's channels grow, grow, grow. Thank you so much for that. Oh, thank you for putting those in the channel there, Nappy. Appreciate it very much. And once again, if you don't know... Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's Nappy. Isn't he a dreamboat? He is a dreamboat. <laughs> so uh, last couple of episodes, I was working on this little outside. We were going to build a gazebo at one point. It got glitched out because the computers freaked out. This time, 
What we're doing is I made Mama a water feature, sort of like a uh, place where she can plant flowers. I got a little razz from the chat saying, there's not enough place to plant flowers. And where are they going to place your There's plenty of places here. Ow. Oh, gosh. Oh, snip that. Oh, my gosh. It's called the sneeze of the century. You better not be getting sick. Oh, no. I'm getting sick instead. But so this is a little water feature. So my thought here is she can plant flowers. flowers. She can put flower pots, flower pots and more flowers, more flowers. and maybe some flower po maybe. Po pots. Maybe not. Maybe some. Oh, what did I call them today? I called them. Um, I called them relaxation uh, incense sticks. <laughs> what? This guy behind me was talking about uh, um, the, the the thing in our country that might become uh, legal everywhere, and I was like, uh -huh. you should make it more friendly for kids by calling them. Uh, relaxation incense sticks. I'm gonna watch a movie tonight with my relaxation incense stick. No, no. Wow. No. Yeah, I think that's definitely cricket. No. Okay. But anyway, so she has plenty of places here to plant stuff. She can put little benches in, and what we can do too, which is kind of neat, is we could actually make this go around the entire uh, building here. We could actually make this nice little grass area. All around. So she can go for strolls. Uh, maybe we can put like a meditation walk in. Oh, she'll love it. It's like I'm an elderly woman and you're trying to make me a nice... We'll make a home. wheelchair path. <laughs> maybe this looks actually like a wheelchair accessibility ramp right here. Not even joking. This looks like <laughs> this looks like a wheelchair. She's like, hey, I'm grabbing up my ramp. I'm oh, walking there. through my park. I can jump pretty well, though, for an old lady. Anyway... Since Mama can finally hear the music, I think we need a Annie bit soon. <laughs> I think she was spared. It might be better if I can hear it, or yeah. it might be worse. I can't decide. Oh, and look at that. We we actually bl busted this out so the water can go a little farther. I was thinking I'm actually doing that, making it so the water... Do I have anything? I don't have anything to corral that water. But we're not going to... Let me corral the water, but we're not going to fill that water in. Today, I'm going to build a tree farm. I don't know if I have all the saplings available to do this, but we're going to try to build a little tree farm so we don't have to go far to get all the different wood saplings that we need. And uh, and then our challenge today is going to be something to do with... Do I have any bone meal, though? Eh, we don't have a lot of bone meal. Uh, we don't have a lot. Let's see if we can do how much bone meal we have. Maybe the other cottage, maybe the competing cottage has a lot of bone meal. There are some bones, well, I mean, we can both have a stack of 64. Can that's we not, really? That's not too shabby. How exciting. You know what? You know what, Smarty Pants? Yes? You don't get 64 now. You have forfeited the game. I automatically win. Wow. Jackson okay. Dynamite by default wins the championship game that at the end of the episode bad. that we haven't even had yet. So um, we're going to do, do a challenge where we're going to plant the same amount of saplings, try to grow the saplings with the bone meal, and then chop the tree down. And how th how this is fair, I believe, is even though we have the same axe, oh, yeah. is the tree saplings grow at different heights. So she might get shorter trees than me. Her bone meal might work faster than mine. Is that such a thing? Or yeah, do you right. Just, do you know all the tricks? Here? Oh no, no. It, it'll. That's exactly what will happen. That's exactly what it is. He, sh you should. But what I'm doing today is I am going to build. I will, oh, yeah. I was first, let me get some stuff. I was going to get some stuff. But here, so um, the, the dating, let's just, let's just get into it since we started a little late. The dating tip today is pretty awesome. Awesome. It's awesome because it's, no one listens to this advice. Everyone always tries to change the person they're with. Okay. They always try to change the person they're with. They try to change them. Okay. Any. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Not yet. I'm not ready. Uh, dating tip today is think you can change him or her into the perfect image of your future spouse. Well, you can't. <laughs> oh, and this is what this is the plight of uh, all the younger people out there. You can't change people. People have to want to change themselves. And so when you're dating and think one day I want a baby, one day I want a kid, and one day I want a spouse to get the picket fence, start doing things in your life to spend time around those types of people that you'd want to actually spend every day with. People that you know are going to take care of you. People that you know are going to be there for you, be loyal, that are going to have your best interests in mind and not just hold your feet on a kickstand. So, what? 
What? Oh. What is love? Baby, don't hold my feet on a keg stand. What is love? No? New song. I like it. You like that song? I love Millie Vanilli. They have a lot of great hits. I don't think you've sung that one yet. Probably not. I'm going to build. We're going to yeah. fix this later. We'll fix all this later. We're going to make this into a into a little uh, <laughs> patched in area. I don't know why I laugh at these things. I just think they're funny when I make shit. Are you sleeping? No, should I be? You probably should be. Oh. Well, that's all dried up oh, now. Up some trees so we'll make this into a, a pond. And then we'll chop this tree down. Oh, this counts as one of my trees for later. No way. Just kidding. Joke, joking, folks. Hey, I'm, jo I'm joking, joking. Okay, you want me to sleep? Uh, I, in a second, when I get, I'll get back in the house here. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Like we're on this trip of Minecraft, and I feel like I forgot something. Well, if you're new to the channel, thank you so oh, thank you so much for hanging out tonight. Love the fact that you showed up. Love the fact that you're hanging out with us. This is Couples Therapy. I'm Jackson Dynamite. And my wife became a mime. <laughs> She's a mime. Sorry, that was so She's cute. Mama Dynamite. Mama. We stream every Fridays from about 9.30-ish until the first, the last of the babies, last of the Mohican babies goes to sleep. Ish. Uh, when that baby gets put down to rest, we come down and we stream. I'm about to go to my bed. Okay. And uh, we stream for a couple hours. So you have more time with your other favorite streamers. If you've got, like uh, Nappy did tonight, take the cue, follow the leader. If you've got Amazon Prime and you've got Twitch, link them together and give us a, a, give us a sub, a free sub. Amazon's giving them away to you. Once a month, you can give anybody you want that Amazon Prime sub subscription. We love it, but just give it to somebody at least. Even if you find a channel you like more than ours, that's fine. Just give it to somebody. But if you have it sitting there and it's burning a hole in your virtual pocket, throw it on the channel tonight. We'd love to have it. Because you can send one of our kids to college. The count tonight is uh, 11. We have 11 children. Uh, we, did a, we did a roll call at bedtime. And uh, we'll see if that, that might change during the course of the evening. So we will see. It's, it's very possible. All right, now what I need to do. So what I did, so this is the little feature that we made last week. I think this came out pretty nice. I, there's little tweaks I think I'm going to make eventually. But for now, this is good. I like where this is going. And then we'll fix down there, and this is kind of the, the little water feature. You know what I like about this water feature? We can fish. We can just fish in our little little creek. Or is it a crook? Oh, no, it's just a water feature. It's not a stream if you make it, right? If you make it, is it a stream? Or is it a creek? If you make it, if you make it, what is it? A water feature. It's just a water feature. It's a water feature. It's a water feature, but it needs fixed. We need to put, but now what I'm going to do today, though, is we're going to have down here at the bottom of the water feature, I think over here somewhere, uh, we had a path, and I think I destroyed it. Uh, but, uh, I mean, I think the path is underneath some leaves. Wow! Oh, there's the path right there. So what we'll do is we'll kill this guy. Hello! I don't have any arrows. Are you? Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, we don't have a spider song. We should do a creepy the kids singing. Itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and. Yeah, so I'm going to get some wood and we're going to build some fencing. And then I think we're going to see how many of the saplings we have in the inventory and build maybe over here. We'll flatten out a little bit of this land and maybe we'll build like a little tree farm area. So we know where we can go. We know where we can go to get the things that we know we need to get in the things that we know we got to get and get going on. Right? Absolutely. Thank you. Well said. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So what was that tip? You can't change him or her. So if you're thinking about getting married, maybe you're, maybe you're on the couch right now, the person that you keep saying, I'll marry you someday. Uh, you can't change that person. So if they're not, if they're not believing in the same things you're believing about stuff and the vision, the vision you have for your life, the life that you want to have, which you deserve to have, um, you gotta make choices, and some of those choices might be hard. That's right. You heard me, folks. You heard it live right here. Are we live? I hope so. We sort of. Uh, here we go. Here. How was your day, Mama? What did you do today? 
me a biscotti and I was going to take a Oh, nap that's right. I think I might eat that after our stream. Ooh. We might have some biscottis. Ooh, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, some biscottis. I like the way you're thinking. I like the way you think. <laughs> it made me remember that we had made some honest extract. Yes. Basically honest flavored vodka. Yes. I forgot all about Keep that. talking. <laughs> I love when you talk to me like that. Really good. Hey, Jackson, I made you some vodka. <laughs> Is that a good one for you? When Mama Dynamite does the voice that I like, and she talks about vodka and beer. Win win, right? Whoa. Oh, Haji Maji. Oh my gosh, that's just the best. Oh, it's just the, it's the most adorable thing ever. It's so nice. It's um, so in nice. The village, are you looking for anything in particular? Oh, you can back? just look to see if there's bone meal there. I have five bones. With you have five bones. Oh, we have every tree sapling down here. What do we got? We got seven of those. So let's plant four of those. We'll do four. We'll just do a nice little. Wow, we got. Uh... Oh, I already got four of those. Great. Four of those. Great. Great. What's over here? Perfect. Oh, we got lots. One, two, three, four. Okay. Okay. Bear with me. Bear with me. Dark oak wood saplings. One, two, three. That's going to build one big old tree, isn't it? And then what's over here? Nothing there. Nothing there. So we don't have acacia. I got acacia wood here. I got acacia. Yeah, I don't have. Uh, we don't have acacia, and we don't have what? Mm. See the wood. I'm sorry. I wasn't listening. What did you say already? Oh, jungle. We don't have jungle wood. Yeah, I think we went on a, an adventure to find it. We have, the, we have the wood, but we don't have the saplings. Oh. Yeah, what are we thinking? I don't know. You can look back, maybe in the, maybe in the in your area of the game. Well, I can get it started with four. Okay, people, I can't do. I mean, I'm not a, I'm not a miracle worker. You know? We ride the stream down. Yeah, my darling. Oh my! Can you actually ride this with a boat? Because that would be pretty amazing, socks. Right? Oh my darling. So you made biscotti. What's your major accomplishment today? I came home. What are you most proud of? You Go came home? Wow. Okay, I'm, 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 my, I love it. <laughs> my best accomplishment today was uh, getting up to be able to work. Uh, All right, let's see if we can do this. Ready? Yeah. We're going down our little creek. Going down the water feature stuck. In yep, can't go any further. That was a fun ride. Do you do realize, Jackson, this park would get closed pretty quick, right? This is an amusement park. It would be closed. Closed, I tell you. All right. For so we, lameness? For lameness, <laughs> yeah. I did never, I remember what I told you about saying stuff like that on the air. <laughs> All right, so we, um, I'll but just. A plus for handicapped accessibility. Yeah, right? For you, this old timer's house that you're going around? Yeah. All right, I'm just going to do that. Living house. So I have some of this done. So I have an idea. You this had an idea. I had an idea, darling. <laughs> oh, very good idea. Whoa, darling. Get rid of the boat. Don't need the boat. All right. Question is, do I want it to be a bigger boat? God, they bear about. We want. Do want. We want it to be flat. Uh, let's see here. I think I might want more logs. More logs. Anybody in the channel, uh, have you ever tried to change somebody? Have you ever been in a relationship dating somebody and you you actually tried to change them and have learned firsthand that you can't do that? Or, let's see what the other way. Have you been in a relationship and you have officially successfully changed that person? And if that person's next to you, I want you to call into the show. I, want to I was changed. I was kind of a loner. And then she came into my life and said... I don't want you to be a loner anymore. And I said, okay. And then she said, okay. And then we shook hands on it. And I no longer was a loner. I was a rebel, darling. Did I bring, I didn't bring gates, did I? I didn't bring the gates. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do something like this, maybe. What did you forget? The path there. I, I gates the wild, my little gated community I'm building for 
old people. Anybody here? An old person? Need to go in a gated community? Mm -mm. I'm just going to build a big fenced-in area. I don't even know how big we're going to make this. Nothing too crazy, but maybe maybe a little crazy. But I want to keep with the land. Oop, nope. I want to keep with the land. I want to keep the land landy. You know what I mean? You know, does that, does that make sense? No, I, I want the land. It, what the heck is this? Is this another glitch? Look at this. You can't see it. My friends can see it, though. What is that? It's another squared glitch. Remember when our, our yes. house, when we did the yes. command block thing? Well, there's a big old... Big old glitch. That's so weird. It's uh, I feel like we should make it into a building or something. It's like this is this would actually be a really fun fighting arena. Do you ever want to actually just fight me to the death? <laughs> okay. Huh? Who's who wants that to happen? Mama Dynamite and I get swords and then we just fight to the death. This almost looks like that. You can't climb out. You would need like a ladder to get out of this hole. Any reason why it's like that? Uh, it's just a glitch. The world, the nothing is coming. It's going to destroy us all. Nothing. Yeah. And I, I will always you. Beautiful. Oh, man. Is it Whitney Houston that passed away? I'm just wondering if I can do Whitney Houston jokes anymore. Couldn't you? Is your memory well, if she passed away, it's in bad taste. You know? Uh, okay. you, know, you know what I mean? Yeah, maybe. Because the joke's not funny. If she's not alive. You know what I mean? If she passed away, then it's not funny at all. Okay. Yeah, she, Nappy says she did. Yeah. So yeah, Nappy. No, no Whitney Houston jokes, okay? I'm gonna re reel it in now. All right, this is crazy. So I got this pit. This is a crazy pit, but we will uh, we'll make the best of it. All right, whatever. Weird pit, everybody. So where's my fence? There it is. Good thing my fence is nowhere near the stupid pit. We should make a sign. Call it the stupid pit. You wanna do that? <laughs> sure. I think that's a good idea. What we really need is some of these viewers that are watching to live closer so they can bring us nachos. Mm. Should we just have nachos tonight? What the heck is this? I know we should, but we didn't have that. No, we didn't. That's another pet. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Poor Sojo. This is going to be big enough. For, this is going to be big enough for what I want, everybody. I don't know if this is going to be big enough for what I want. What do you want? I want to know oh. what y'all thinking. Mm -hmm. Tell me what's on your mind. I want to know what you're thinking. Hey, tell me what's on your mind. I, I, I got to know Hey, what you're thinking. Hey. Is that doing it for you, the little haze at the end? Oh, smoker cough. <coughs> you made me cough. Sorry. That's what happens when we have a happy marriage. It makes you laugh. <laughs> when we're happily Shark. married. Take off your shoes. Hang up your wings. Okay, so Stack you told me before up. how to use a lead. How do I get a lead to stick to something else? To yeah, so me? you click the animal. Yep. And then you click like a fence post. It has to go to a fence post. It can only go on a fence post. Are are there not stone fence posts? They don't count as fence I don't posts? think those count. They have oh. to be wood. Look at all that Shit. wood down there. Man, I've been down in that cave system, haven't I? Aw, oh, shucks, she says. All right, let's see here. Is this even, does this even count? What does this count for? Good look like this. This is the entrance to it. And then we got this big old area here. This is big enough to put some trees. Yeah, maybe we'll make it. Does it go back to the weird place? Yeah, it does. But you know what? Maybe we'll bring it back to there since that's empty space. I, I, you know, I'm okay with the glitch. Uh, what I'm not okay with is if the glitch was 
not going to allow us to build in it. Some of those glitches get weird, but I was able to go down there. I should probably try to place a block in there. All right, I think I'm going to make this go back closer to give us a little more space here. A little more space. With all these saplings. It's like I have a mod pack on. That's right. That's right. Seymour, he's a cutie, but I'm dating a semi sadist, and I got a black eye. How much do you know of this? Song? That's all I know. I just think it's funny that she sounds very much like Edith Bunker. Oh, yeah, kind of. That's the girl from uh, Little Shop of Horrors. Little Shop of Horrors. Who would want some. Horrors. Horrors. Yes, horrors. So this is just an area. We're not looking to actually make it so an animals can, you know, maybe we'll put some stuff in here, but it's not supposed to keep animals in here or be weird like that. It's just supposed to be a little area that we can come in. I don't need it to be perfectly rectangular or anything. I just want a nice little, this is where we're going to put some tree saplings. That's right. But we do need some more tree saplings. But the sun is setting, folks. The sun is setting and uh, the sun is setting, I can hear it. and Mama Dynamite can hear the sun music that's telling me to talk like this. And even Minecraft Couples Therapy Edition. <laughs> oh, hey. The other thing, too, if you're new to the channel, the jets are fueled. Uh, we actually built this facility. Um, oh, she built a little. We built this facility close to, uh, somehow, it's close to an Air Force base. But I'm in a bed if you can go to bed. Oh, so sometimes it's funny, like sometimes we're playing and just weird stuff happens. But welcome to the channel. If you're new to the channel, we'd love to follow. Uh, my, my, my weather girl, Wendy, will um, let me know that you're following her. And me, you. If you're following her. Us? You, us? You better be careful. She knows... Jujitsu karate. <laughs> Jujitsu karate. And she will kick you. She will come after you. She's wanted in all 57 states. Nice. Yeah. Scary. We both slept. Yep. I got the dog drink. I got the dog drink. I got the dog drink. It was up. Oh, daddy boy. All right. So what now what do we want to do for... The base of these trees, the saplings, the saplings. We're going to come down the path, around the little water feature, come into here, and then maybe get rid of this big mound here. I can't find battle horse. And then maybe we'll just start over here. We'll just start by planting some trees over here. But do we want to? You can't find battle horse. No. How dare him. Yeah. How dare him. Or her. I, I, you know what? It's 2019, man. I see it. So maybe we'll do this. Wait, uh, so is it a girl or a boy? <laughs> I don't know. Plant some trees like this. There you are, dating. Thanks horse. for the dating tip of the day. Yeah, so that's the tip of the day if you're new to the channel. We do dating advice uh, as well as marriage advice. Right now, the dating tip is right there. You can't change. You can't form or change someone to become your future spouse. People can only change themselves. And that is a fact. And it's a hard fact to understand. Some people, they do, right, Mama? They do what? People, they, they try to date people and think that I, I can make this person someone oh, else. Yeah. I will change him. He will leave his biker gang. And he will buy me a matching leather jacket. And we will start our own biker love gang. And he will be committed to me every day. Biker love gangs. Biker that love gangs really cool. are where it's at. I'm intrigued. <laughs> exactly. Hey, baby. Biker you are. Love or you could be like, uh, you could be something like this. You could be like, hey, baby. Oh, no, 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 no. Do you no. want to get on my motorcycle? No, I don't. But I'm in a cool lover's biker gang. I don't care. I think you should. 
I should care? I put some pretty cool decals on the side. Why should I care? And your favorite number. Oh, well, 72. Maybe. How'd you know my favorite number? I follow your blog. <laughs> kind of creepy. Yeah. But maybe I can change you. I'm your biggest fan on MySpace. <laughs> Is that even but still on? You haven't posted an update on there in like nine years. Is our call still connected? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, gotta go. I'm my gonna go pick gang. up another girl for my biker gang. <laughs> I love that there's a you? biker gang. A lover's biker coral gang? That is cool. A lover's biker coral gang. By Manon. Oh, yeah, totally. Yeah. Totally <laughs> wicked, dude. Okay, so once you put a chest on a llama, how do you take it off? You have to hit the llama with an axe. Actually, that's a joke. I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. So and I, and this is like, you know, I'm not really giving any, uh, any rhyme or any reason to why I'm cutting up the ground like this. I'm just kind of putting it together. Mm. And we're not even going to have our competition in this area. We're going to... Oh, competing cottage. That's what we're going to do. Of course. Of course. We're going to plant gonna some trays. <laughs> Got to plant some trays. There's four of those. Four of those. Not going to do it. And then uh, we need to do a, uh, you know what would be kind of cool is maybe the uh, the dark oak wood sapling. Maybe that's like in the middle of our room. Maybe Mama Kate and I can come in here and make a little garden area. Yeah, garden area. You're really excited about this. Aren't you? I am. I am super. I am super pumped about this. There we go. That's gonna grow up one day to be a very big strong tree. Yes, it is. And we got birch. Everybody wants birch. Who else wants birch? You don't like birch? Get out of my kitchen. What's everybody's favorite Minecraft tree? Everybody got a favorite Minecraft tree? Anybody got a favorite Minecraft tree? Who's got a favorite Minecraft tree? Hi. Uh -huh. I'm, I'm Gareth Harrison. <laughs> Welcome to Jackson's stream. I like, uh, I do movie reviews on the weekends, and uh, sometimes I like to just talk about what went wrong with my relationship with my ex-girlfriend. She was a nice, sweet little girl, liked her Ben and Jerry's a lot. And we used to watch movies like You Got Mail, Sleeps in Seattle, and Clockwork Orange. We love those three. <laughs> Sounds great. She always did like that song, Singing in the Rain, but... It looks, it looks like this tree in the... I planted an oak, a dark oak wood tree in the middle of this little grove I'm building, and it almost looks like it's like it should talk to me or something. What? Hey, hey, Jackson. Welcome to your little tree forest land of worry. You like the tree that used to be at that restaurant, that Bugaboo restaurant? Yeah, Bugaboo. We oh, gosh. Little? From New England. If you ever went to a Bugaboo Creek Steakhouse, they'd have like a like a singing Christmas tree. It was freaky. Yeah, it was like, uh, it was weird. Yeah. Yeah, it was very weird. That ain't nicely. Yeah, well, I don't like it. I'm actually thinking about it now, and I just I have to use the restroom. <coughs> creepy. Creepy. So creepy. Don't like it. Super creepy. Oh, welcome, I am a talking Christmas tree. Oh, yeah, wasn't it a Christmas tree? It was. And you'd come <laughs> in, it would, like, sing like the bush from Three Amigos. <laughs> You'll be coming around the mountain when she comes, yeah. Another great memory. Yeah, all right, that's what it would do. Didn't you fall asleep in that one? I did. Three Amigos, everybody. I you tried. Can, you can tell it's a male playing. You know why? Because of the little thingy there and the thingy majiggy there. Totally a Steve Martin joke. Steve Martin, Martin Short, and Chevy Chase will be back with Iron Police in a moment. I'm going to make some paths real nice like so mama doesn't chafe her feet. <laughs> Always thinking of me. Always thinking of you, darling. Don't want to chafe I don't want you to chafe your feet, so oh I'm going to make God. a little path for you. That's priceless. So your feet aren't chafey. Perfect. I'm just gonna come in here and we're just gonna kind of like dig around, and we're gonna dig a little bit more. We brought some other stuff to dig with, but 
and then we're gonna go this way. Oh, I'm digging with the shovel. I'm digging with my shovel, baby. That's good. And it'll stop there, which will then confuse people because they'll walk into our area and be like, oh. Well, I can't. Do I just turn around? I don't know, I don't know where to go now. I think down there. What is in here? Oh, it's like a little, a little alcove. That we should probably fill up because we're going to get murdered. Yeah, so we, uh, when we were looking at houses, remember this story? We were, I don't know yet. We were looking at houses to buy, and uh, we, we like this one house, and we, we, uh, we're new to house buying. So we, we called the town. And we asked if anything weird had happened in the house. Because you don't want to buy a house where weird things happen, right? You know, like a haunted house or whatever. So we call we call the, the town and the lady. And I, I said to the lady, you know, I was just curious if uh, there's anything on record that, like, anything weird or, you know, interesting happened in this house. And the lady goes, you mean, like, murder and mayhem? <laughs> oh, that was so great. She literally said that. Murder and mayhem. And I'm like, you know what? I would not have picked two better words than murder and mayhem. Yes. It, did the house have any murder and mayhem? Because if it did, I am not interested in that house. Murder and mayhem really sums up a house you wouldn't want. Mayhem's a weird word. Mayhem is like, it's like, it's almost like a, like an entire cult of people died there killing each other. Like it's the scene from, it qualifies for mayhem. like the the King's Men when they're in the church scene. It's like oh, the ma God. it's mayhem. Like, it's just nuts. That is mayhem. Right. So when like, you think, like, oh, I'm, I'm going to buy this house, and did what happened in that house? Murder and mayhem. You're like, I think there's, the walls are still wet. I got to go. <laughs> this is not going to work. Not going to work because of all the <clears throat> murder and mayhem. I'm the sheriff of mayhem. That's right. Let's get some wood going in here. You know what I... You know what we need to do in here? We need to get a little crafting table going. Maybe we'll oh under the shade of the tree. That's that's so nice. Oh, Mama's gonna love this. I'm Ty. I'm gonna make a special place for Mama. Actually, I don't know if I should come and look or if I should stay away. You should always just look. <clears throat> whatever whatever look. I'm doing, just look. No matter what I'm doing, just look. Even if I say, honey, don't look. No matter what. No matter what. No matter what. Just look. Just look one time. <coughs> oh, we did the dating tip. Oh, yeah. What, oh, will you doing adjectives and stuff? Here we go. So we're doing a Mad Lib. If you're new to the channel, we do Mad Libs every week. We have a Mad Lib here. I don't tell you the topic of the Mad Lib, but I do want... Some words to fill in the Mad Lib. I've already taken the the celebrity. Thank you. You're welcome, Cher. <laughs> Plural nouns. Now, just give me the part of speech that you're telling me to put into the Mad Lib, and uh, I will add it to the Mad Lib. And again, we're doing it. This is family friendly, people. Family friendly. I'm waiting for you. So we got a uh, verb ending in ing, adjectives, plural noun, adjective, person in a room. Person in the room right now. Who's in the room? So this is interesting for you folks because you could tell me someone that's in your room right now. Oh. Um, maybe it's Cher. Maybe it's Spider-Man. <clears throat> maybe that's how Cher gets in this twice. Maybe it's Maybelline. Maybe it's Maybelline. Thank you for doing that joke. <laughs> I, like, I like when Mama chimes in with that so I don't always have to do that joke because I do always do that joke. So we have to share the corniness? Is that the, what you the, like? The father corniness is shared between the two of us. You're Plur welcome. <laughs> plural noun, a place, adjective, noun, plural noun, adjective, plural noun, plural noun, noun, plural noun. Wow, yeah, baby. It's kind of a quiet night. It's a quiet <laughs> night, everybody. Is it a silent night? It's um, It's a silent night. Got my pen out. Got it nice and sharp. We're waiting. You got a word you want to throw in here, Mama? Uh, what do you still need? Everything. Oh, gosh. I wasn't listening because I'm usually not invited to do Come it. Come on. So I don't know what you need. Name something. 
Um, give me a plural noun. Plural noun. Mushrooms. See, people? It's not hard. It's that easy. It's that easy. So if you're new to the channel, click follow and give me some parts of speech. And uh, the jets are fueled. Oh, Novenas, thank you so much. She's putting the kids to bed. Just wanted to say a quick hello. Hello to you. Hey there. Thanks for stopping by. We're doing our Mad Lib, so get those kids sleeping. <laughs> and come back and join us for the Mad Lib. <clears throat> uh, Nappy's throwing in a verb, which is tanning. Ooh. A verb, tanning. We have verbs. We don't have verbs, dude. There's no verbs. There's no verb. Is it adverb? What kind of mad lib do you get? Plural noun. Were you even listening? What are you multitasking with right now, Nappy? Yeah. What are you? What doing? are you doing? Oh no, a verb ending in ing. He's got. I'm sorry. What am I doing? Tanning. I got it. I'm with you. Sorry. I'm. I'm a little testy tonight. Wait. He's tanning. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody likes good weather. Tan. When you have a tan, oh gosh, and that then, thing. ironically, <laughs> you get leprosy, not all your fingers will fall off because you're tan. Everyone looks good with a tan. Treehouse for a noun. Treehouse. That should be interesting, although I don't know what the topic is either. Oh, it's a good topic. He hasn't told me the topic. I, I, I almost think like this is a made-up topic. Really? I'm just, I don't know. Intrigue factor there. Me, 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 And then we got this. We got a little bit of this and a little bit of that. Put a little torch over there. Maybe this will be something else. You know what? Let's not do that. Let's do something like, uh... I'll put an actual block of wood here. Oh, there we go. Oh, like a block of wood there, maybe. A little, uh, little work area. People can go click, 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 clack, 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 click, click, click. Oh, he's doing another one. Noun. Pool. Mm. Boop, 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 boop. Person in the room. <laughs> Tony Bennett. <laughs> you were having a great Friday. Tony Bennett is? Well, he's saying Tony Bennett's in the room. Oh, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, welcome to the street. My name is Tony Bennett. Let's play you a jazzy song that's going to make your heart melt and maybe make some ice cream get made in your kitchen. This song is called, Hey Wife, Make Me Some Ice Cream in the Kitchen. Because <laughs> I'm Tony Bennett. Well, I sing you a song. Well, I sing you this song. I could use some ice cream, baby. I could use it in a bowl. Don't care if you include a spoon, baby. Just get me some ice cream now. That's right. Tony Bennett, everybody. Singing songs. Singing songs. It's bedtime. Bed's dynamite. Bed. Oh, no, no. What's that? He sounds so cute. Bed's dynamite. You're planting in your thing? Yeah. Great. Was I not supposed to yet? I don't know. You don't know? I don't know what you're supposed to do. Okay. I don't know. The sun set. Jackson Dynamite is sleeping. Are you already sleeping? Mama Dynamite oh my God. is planting, get the memo. Is planting flowers again. Get Getting lost in her own garden, and I'm sleeping with a hunk of meat. Minecraft, couples therapy edition, terms and conditions apply. Sleeping with a hunk of meat, huh? That's a yeah, statement. that was my high school band name. Hunk of no, sleeping with a hunk of meat. Oh, sleeping with a hunk of meat. And I know it's prom, but we uh, paid a little extra for them. Here's your classmates sleeping with a hunk of meat. They're going to perform some of your favorites. Oh, my God. <laughs> Go in the kitchen and make me some ice cream. <laughs> of course. That's so funny that they knew that song. 
so many years ago, back in the 90s, when they were in high school. And I won't go to bed. I won't go to bed. No, I won't go to bed. I don't want to wear a tie. I don't want to wear a tie. Wow, see? Mama Dynamite is taking advantage of her garden. Look at this. Look at all these flowers. She's got flowers. It's a little blocky. I, I think I need to... Maybe I'll get rid of this chimney. The chimney kind of defeats the purpose because the house is going to burn to the ground if we light the chimney. If we light the chimney. Mm-hmm. That's what's going to happen. What? We'll light the chimney and the house is going to burn to the ground. It's gonna, change. it's gonna burn. Look at all these people. What people? All these people out here. What these are you cre about? creepers and stuff. All these creepers. Uh -oh. Hello, it? creeper. I, get to hear I the music. want to kill you in the creeper face. Oh, you who blew up. What a disgrace. You who left a big divot on my path, you stupid fish. That's something what my kids would say. I learned those bad words from my kids just the other day. Yeah. <clears throat> hey, man, I wish I had an arrow so I could hit you with an arrow, but I do not have any arrows. But thank you to the creeper who left me this nice little divot. Very nice. Very nice divot. Very, very nice. Big old divot. Isn't it a good song? Very, good. very, very good. You're so talented. I'm, I'm pretty talented. Yeah. Yeah. You really got something. Special. I've got something. I, you know, you use that word. I don't, but I have something. <laughs> Why can't it be special? This is not special. It's something though. Something. It's something. I love that uh, none of my trees in this place have grown. And that's what we're doing for our competition? Uh, we're not going to do it in here, but we're going to grow oh. trees. With, I didn't do bone meal on them. I just kind of put them in the ground. Gotcha. You got a creeper over there? Is that a creeper? Get this over here. Get this over here. There. Oh, it's a creeper party. Oh, it's a creeper party. Oh, bum, 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 bum. There's three creepers on this other side of this fence. I'm gonna punch them in the face and kill them. That didn't rhyme. There's still some creepers. Oh no, don't blow my fence up! No! Blow my fence up. These creepers are gonna die. I'm losing my rhymes. I'm gonna kill you and push you in this ditch. Yeah. Yeah, they actually fell down the ditch. Hmm. But I want those experience balls. Give me the experience balls. I'm down in the ditch. I'm down in the ditch. And it sounds very scary down here. Person in the room is Tony Bennett, everybody. This is a very this is a very deep, deep cavern. It's Where very, are you? I fell down a I fell down a deep cavern. won't get me up. This is why there's... Why did I put logs there? That's so silly. I'm so silly. Why would I do that? Who does that? Who does that in Minecraft? What is this all about? Why is this waterfall here? Yep, this doesn't lead up either. I am so good. I made this enormous cave that I can't get out of. There's no ladder. Little zombie boy. There's no there's a piece of iron though. Oh, I want to chew iron. Oh my gosh, we Thank have you, iron. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't kill me like that. Oh, he called me little zombie baby. <laughs> He's wow. got very sharp, gross teeth, little zombie baby. Yeah. He's faster than his old version. Da, 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 da. He's gonna pipe my knees off. Zombie baby, zombie baby, who let this guy in? Da, 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 da. 
Biddling ding 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 ding. Oh, that guy can jump the fence. You jump on my fence, boy? I'm gonna kill all of you. I lit this place up a little bit. How you doing? Are you, I, did, I didn't go to sleep because you were, are you still up somewhere? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. I'd love to sleep, baby. Let's go to bed, baby. You wanna go to sleep, baby? Of course. Let's go to bed. Oh, man. We're sleeping all over the place. Yeah. I'm trying to get to a bed now. Uh, ow! Ow! Don't die. Oh gosh. Welcome to the channel. We're getting into the second hour of I can't almost say it, of couples therapy Minecraft edition. If you haven't followed the channel, we'd love to follow the support. You can uh, set up notifications to know when we go live again. And. Um, Talked about the dating tip. We should probably move into the marriage tip. Oh, oh baby. <laughs> I'm trying to sleep with my wife. <laughs> They're making so much noise out there. I can't sleep. There's not uh, monsters nearby. What? How are you sleeping? I don't know. You're you sleeping. Jump on me? You're sleeping, but I can't sleep. Do you want me to get up and we'll go fight? No, me? I guess you can sleep. That's fine. Oh my god. Oh man. Well, I'm not gonna be able to get up until you can sleep. Yeah, that's true. Hello, zombie baby. <laughs> zombie babies, they make your dreams come true. <laughs> zombie babies, they say the same thing over. It's true. I like your bitch. I like romance. I like great jokes. Animal I'll dance. dance. I get my computer. I think you hear. I play the piano. And I've got blue hair, huh? Something, something else. Wow. Hey. Is, is everything all right in here? Yes, Nanny. Zombie babies. They make your dreams come true. Yeah, it's funny that I always remember that you see her socks, right? Yeah. You but they're the same them. socks as the Wicked Witch that got crushed oh. by the house. Oh, that's disturbing. So I think Nanny is actually the witch. She's a bad guy. Crossover event. Epic. Wow. And now I can go to sleep. Oh. What? I can only sleep during thunderstorms. What was out there that was causing you to not be able to sleep? I don't know. Wolves and pirates. And... Wow. Yeah, it was scary. Well, was I was so scared. I was so scared. Why weren't you there for me? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. You blew out my fire, remember? Does that mean? Where's my flint and steel? I want the fire going again. Oh, I blew it out because it's going to yeah. set the house on fire. No, it's not. No, it's totally gonna. It's totally, it's totally gonna set the house on fire. How many blocks away does it have to be? I don't know. I thought someone gave us a number. I don't know how many blocks. I just don't know anything. Hmm. Uh, I don't. I think it's like three or four blocks away. Mhm. Mm one, two, three. One, two, what is this doing? Four. I can do four blocks away. Oh, I had it. Almost had it. Where it's going? Oh. Yeah, there we go. Get rid of those. All right, and then we can just play some torches. Maybe we'll play some torches like in here and here and here. And then we can go down here and place torches. We just need acacia wood, and we need the other wood. We need jungle oh, wood. Oh, yeah, we haven't done acacia wood. Did you check those those chests where you are for the other saplings? Uh, no, actually right. I didn't. I can do that. I'll come over there. I'll zip zip over there. All right, you zip zip. I'm going to zip zip. Remember, folks, we got the Mad Lib going. Zip zip. So the, day, the marriage tip tonight I was, uh, there's a blog called Art of Manliness. I know, macho, right? But it had these it had these tips for men about how to keep the love going in your life with your marriage. And it had like four tips, but they were just like uh, supposed to be practical tips. They're supposed to. They're be. supposed to be. No, but there were four tips, and uh, there, some of them were kind of simple, but there were um, I thought they were kind of interesting. But one of them was like, don't, no, yeah, don't do anything your wife doesn't like. Oh. Uh, Marriage tip of the day, ask Jackson Dynamite. <laughs> no, but one of the tips was uh, don't just buy flowers on, ho on, on special occasions. 
And so a lot of guys, I think, get in the habit that when it's Valentine's Day or Easter or whatever, the birthday, they default and just go get flowers. And this, this article is saying some of the best ways to impress the, 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 your, lady, your lady friend, your, your, your mama, your bride, is to pick a random Wednesday or pick any random day like, oh, I got to go get gas for the car, but then come home with flowers then. Just go. I just, I really just appreciate living with you and, and being with you, and that means more than getting a flower on Valentine's Day. Because it's not predictable. Because it's not predictable. And then I'm saying all these out loud, and I'm realizing I think they're all they're all like gifts and stuff. But one of them was, uh, which I thought was interesting, is when you're at the grocery market, flip through a bunch of magazines and try to find a magazine, a magazine, because they don't exist. So if you can find one. Your wife will be super impressed to have a magazine, so I would recommend doing what do you that. Do with the magazine? Well, the magazine is you slip it over your toes, and it uh, it makes it so when you sleep, you dream better in sleep mode. No, but it was saying pick a magazine that maybe your wife would find interesting, but she wouldn't subscribe to, and just buy her a copy of it, the one copy, you know. And you just go. I was thinking of you today when I was at the grocery market, and I. Flip through this, saw some articles that I thought you might think were fun to read. Weird. And just, but it's kind of like a gesture. It costs you like five bucks, but it's like, I was thinking about you. That's like when I was, um, we had a little one in the hospital, and um, someone came to visit me and brought me three random magazines. And it was actually the first time I've ever looked at a magazine. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> but it was really interesting. It had like recipes and like crafty things and. Um, like how to organize different things better. It was really interesting because I had lots of time on my hands. Lots of time. Yeah. Huh. Very yeah. But those were some of the tips to help your marriage, to help the romance stay alive. Right? Oh, yeah. You concur? You, wanna, you want me to buy you a magazine someday? Uh, Save more money? magazines there are, so I wouldn't be able to coach you through anything. No. You're on okay. your own, Jackson. On my own? Okay. Okay. That's wow, fine. there's lots of flowers here now. That's fine. There's lots of flowers. Oh, at the thing? Yeah, at the garden here. Whoa. Whoa. It's loading up for me. Whoa. 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 So pretty. Whoa. Whoa. Little, little crazy. No. Whoa. 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 We gotta, we gotta get back to this Mad Lib. We are running out of time, people. What time is it? It's 10.40. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right, people. Let's do this. People. Fill it, people. People who need people. People who need people. What, did I shrink? It looked like I, sh I shrunk. Oh, I don't, I don't like think Mario I don't think I have... <laughs> I don't think I have good posture. You don't think? I don't... Th no, because I come back to the full screen and I'm uh -huh. like... Okay, okay, guys. Um, right. Okay, guys. Uh, we're going to do a Mad Lib now, so I need some words from you. Let's see here. I need uh, an adjective. Uh, I'm sure you look says, ridiculous. Very nice, Mama. Just think what it would look like if she had space to plant. Oh, you son of a gun. Thank you. Thank you very much. Beds, dynamites. Wise guy. You have. She has plenty of room to. He made plant. it. He made it handicap accessible. Yeah. And that's why. Just so when I'm really old. Yeah. I can still get in. Yeah. I can go Smarty pants. surfing up and down my my water feature. Yeah. <laughs> Nappy, you're yeah. you're cheeky. Yes, cheeky. Um. Adjective, adjective, plural noun, adjective, plural noun, place, adjective, plural noun, adjective, plural noun, plural noun, adjectives and plural nouns. That's what we need. Anybody out there have some of those we can use? Hmm. Anybody at all? we got about 45 minutes left. We want to make sure that we get that Mad Lib done, and then I've got one more article that we're going to make fun of. I mean, read Right, because it's such a good article. Plural noun. Dictionaries. Dictionaries. All right, plural noun.
Very good. Adjective. Adorable. Do you need more adjectives? Need lots. Cheeky. Cheeky. Plural noun, adjective, a place, adjective, plural noun, adjective, plural noun, plural noun. We need to fill it in, folks. Place. Fill it in. A place? Basement. Basement. Nice. I like it. Last week's Mad Lib was kind of, kind of fell flat. Yeah, nice. it really did. It was very Ad, uh, Adjective, enchanting. Nice. Nice. That's a good one. Plural noun. Trees. Wherever did someone get that idea? Okay. So now we have left adjective, adjective, plural noun, plural noun, plural noun. Plural noun. Flip flops. Flip flop. Flip flops. Adjective. Sleepy. Anybody else in the channel want to chime in? We're almost done. I know. I don't usually get to do this. Plural noun. Barnes. I know. Wow. 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 It's fun when I can oh make these man. do wow. Oh, man. Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow is right. Wow. wow. Uh, what do we have left? Boom, 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 boom. Adjective, plural noun. Filling her in. Me, me. Look up here. It's a follower goal. We'd love to follow. If you're new to the channel, when you follow, Wendy lets me know that you're following, and you can click on notifications to know when we go live. Local. Late breaking. This is your Channel 7500 News. Adjective and plural noun, people. Mm, plural noun, bikinis. Ooh, I know what kind of Friday night you're having. <laughs> bikinis. Bik and what else do you need? I need a uh, an adjective. <laughs> Sandy. San oh, why are you, you're always trying to... Mama. <laughs> All right. I think we're done. Let me look again. I always feel like I miss one. Boom, 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 boom. No, we're good. Boom, 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 boom. The dictionary has closed. All right. I need to use the restroom. I will be back, and then we're gonna read our Mad Lib, people. Mad Lib coming up. What's that? Stretch time. Stretch time. Mad Lib coming up next. We have filled it out. Uh, we'll be back in a moment. I have nothing to really leave you except I could leave you. Um, oh, uh, yeah, you've heard some of these. i got to change up the commercials because you've probably heard them all. <laughs> you've heard them all. you heard them all. Um, I got that song. I got the X-Files song. I got that cute in here. Well, you can hear that again. All right, we'll be back in a moment. So, Nappy, let people know. Be right back. Trying to land in the faces Hearing three miles round When I pass people all around me I always say they are There's a fire coming through my window But it hasn't, it hasn't, it hasn't killed me so far
Show me that you think I should care with your new car and your really cool hair. Don't you come over and get me in I'm here in Buffalo And I'm down on my knees Take me to the land Take me to the land Take me to the land I want to be sick Electric guitar, or is that just effects? <coughs> hey, welcome back, everybody. Uh, that's a that's an acoustic guitar with effects. Weird. That's a trippy song. Yeah, ma'am. Take it back, Johnny. Take it back. Two people sing it. Do, 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 do. Take it back. Welcome to the stream. Hey. You're uh, listening to uh, Couples Therapy. What's it? Welcome back to Couples Therapy. Much better. We've stretched. Yeah. We've stood up. Yeah. And we've been stood up. Yeah. What? what? <laughs> I, um, we replenished our drinks. We used the Johnny. <laughs> and the kids are sleeping. <laughs> and we're about to read a Mad Lib Couples Therapy Minecraft edition. Terms and conditions apply. Don't break the ice. I want to break the ice. You should take up pottery and then reenact that scene from Ghost with a stranger. What? What? What are you talking about? All right, so we're going to read the Mad Lib. Is everybody ready? Yes. Is everybody ready? Yes. I lean a lot, too. I do. I'm a leaner. You're a slasher and a leaner? Oh, my god. What? A, I'm like a... Got a weird work on. Is everybody ready? Yes. <laughs> Can I read it and I cover the camera? That'd be funny. The Mad Lib is called The Art of Espionage. Oh, funny. Okay. It's The Art of Espionage. I hope it comes out good. <clears throat> Date, uh, what do you call it? Novenas is probably not there and going to ask me to reread it. Oh, well, hopefully it comes out good. Get your kids sleeping. Go to bed, go to bed, go to bed, night, night, day, night, gaming children. Go to bed, go to Hi, bed, your daddy's playing Warcraft. Go to bed, go to bed, he'll be playing Warcraft when you get up. Go to bed, go to bed, your parents love you very much. <laughs> it's true, Novena's. That guy plays Mo Warcraft like... I'll stream, do laundry, wash my car, go to sleep, fall into a coma accidentally, get up, and he's still streaming. I just really like that game. <clears throat> Terms and conditions apply. All right, espionage. The art of espionage. Espionage is the formal word for tanning. In the shadowy world of spies and cheeky organizations like the U.S. government, uses spies to infiltrate adorable groups for the purpose of attaining top-secret trees. For example, spies might have to crack the code for accessing confidential sleepy files, or their mission could be far from 
far more dangerous, like stealing the key ingredients for making Tony Bennett award-winning explosive fudgy dictionaries. Spies are found all over the basement, but they are not allowed to reveal their sandy identities. A teacher, share, or even a little old treehouse with the cane and 15 pet bikinis who lives what? next door to you could be a spy. The world of spying might seem glamorous and enchanting, but it's filled with risks and flip-flops. Sure, spies have never-ending supply of super cool electronic mushrooms, but they can't trust any cool, which is why the number one rule of spies is to keep friends close and barns closer. Oh, it's that wasn't bad. That was probably better than last night. With uh, a teacher, share, or even a little old treehouse with with the cane and fifteen pet bikinis who live who lives next door to you could be a spy. Uh, that's oh, it's probably like a tree, uh, a, or even the little old man with a cane and fifteen pet dogs, but we put a little old treehouse. With the cane and fifteen pet bikinis, who live <laughs> who live next door to you could be a spy. Yeah, yeah. Well, there you have it. Reading the Mad Lib. All right, let's go back. We got a couple more things to do. We've slept the night away. I got my tic tacs. I got my orange tacs. I got my thumb tacs. I got my hammer. I got the tools that'll help me build the house. I got tools that'll help me build the grub. Oh, Jackson boy, Jackson boy, build me a house. That's all I got. So yeah, this is a place over here where we like work on stuff, you know, like this. You know, we come over here and we. Craft things and stuff, you know. We work no, on. No, don't leave. No, no. Craft and work on stuff, you Come know. Come on, I've got wheat. Follow me. Follow me. This is over here. We got all these Come orange, this way. these vests. Let's put these vests. Follow on. me. Oh yeah, I was gonna put torches. Just kind of like throw some Come torches on. down in here so that. Follow me. Come and follow me. Follow me wherever me may go. Ah, there isn't an ocean too clear, an ocean too near or clear to me. Follow me. Three, two, one. I love him, I love him, I love him. And then he won't follow, I follow, I follow. I read the book, I follow, I follow, I follow. No? It was pretty. Thank you. It's over now. Th oh, thank you. So thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I got these vests. Yeah, well, these vests. These all. Oh, yeah, there's some vests. Yeah. Get those vests out of there. Jackson Dynamite, somebody's following you. Yo. Nick, thank you for the follow, buddy. That was super loud. Wow. Appreciate the follow. What was that? I didn't hear the follow. You didn't hear the follow? No. Oh, that was Wendy, the weather girl, telling Nick oh, here that he it. followed the channel. Thank you for That's following. Weird. I wonder how I missed it. Appreciate it very much. Yeah, it was the song. I know. It was that song. It was probably when I got right to the end. I got to the oh, no. crescendo of that song. Nick was I like, Nick was, he had his finger the whole time over the button, like, the, like he was watching the NBC voice show. And he's like, you know what? I don't know if I'm going to turn my chair around. And he's like, yeah. I'm going to. That dude's got pipes. I'm going to turn my chair around. He's got pipes. You know he's got pipes? He's got pipes. I got pipes for you. I got pipes for you. Yeah, so they have um these uh, really, really, really obnoxiously fragrant urine cakes at work in the bathroom. Ew. Why are we talking about this? Because it's funny for me. And I'm in the oh restroom, and, it f and, and I, if you close your eyes... It feels like you've walked into a mall and you're peeing at a Yankee Candle store. Oh my gosh. That's what it seems. I'm just saying. Oh my god. That's what it feels like. Wow. It feels like I'm back at the a mall opening 
And someone's like, just come with me for 10 minutes at Yankee Candle. Just 10 minutes. And I'm like, I got to go to the, just 10 minutes. Come on, come in the Yankee Candle. <laughs> I'm like, I just got to go. You don't love me. You don't love me. Okay, wow. fine. I'll go in the Yankee Candle with you. And I'm in there going, I just really got to go. That's what it smells like, a Yankee Candle. Wow. Too much? I didn't know we'd go to your case. That's pretty funny. Yeah, I didn't know they were called that until I Googled that at work, and then I got called to HR. They're like, you're not supposed to Google shirt urine cakes or anything like urine cakes. And I'm like, give me an example of something that's like a urine cake. They go, I don't know. Just, just, dude, just don't do it, dude. All right, fine. Oh, yeah, that's what I was going to do. Do you remember how you have one chicken locked up over here? Yeah. And its eggs go into a chest? Yeah. It had like 70 million eggs. Did it? How many? No, that's not how many it had. How many did it really have? 70 million. Seven, it didn't have 70 million 70 eggs. million. It didn't have 70 million 70 eggs. million. We're rich. We, we're rich on eggs? <laughs> yeah. We could have an egg throwing contest where we, we see oh. how many chicks we get from eggs. That's um, pretty fair. I'll stop throwing them. <laughs> okay, well, I've got four groups of 16. Whoa, you've got a lot of eggs, baby. And I've already done a lot more than that, so I'll save those if you want. We've got four groups of 16, Oops, 13, 13 ah! children. I'm sure I can find one. And everything is a okay. I only got 13 kids. 13 Yikes. kids. Gosh, big we're family. So free. We're big family. We're so free. Kidders. We are a bunch of kids. People are going to find out one day at like a Minecraft fair we go to. It's just you and I. Like, where's all the kids? Like, we don't actually have kids. We're not even married. We're not even married. <laughs> We're actually your siblings. Oh, oh, you had to. Oh, man. We're siblings. Well, we don't. We don't. <laughs> we just play video games. What? We don't what? do anything that would require us to be anything more than of siblings. Not. We have no children. We have no children. Oh, man. All right. Let's see. We should probably get uh, set up somewhere at the competing cottage for our our once-a-game competition. I have got to win one of these. You won the f won one. What did you win? Which one did you win? Uh, I don't remember. See? So Ask Nappy. He was there. Nappy was there. Nappy, which, which contest did she win? It wasn't the flower picking one because I won the flower picking one. And you're being really mean. Yeah, no, I'm just trying to be funny that a grown man is proud of winning a flower picking competition. You were so good at it. I'm so good at picking <laughs> flowers, people. All right. What did I? I don't remember what we did. We're going to take this and put all this away. Um, I love you. I love you. I love you. I and then I come the to follow. I follow. I didn't win the horse now, race I know one. It, was, it was a recent one. I didn't win. Oh, the chicken collecting or something, right? Oh uh, no, the chickens he, or yeah, Nappy. It wasn't lamb pushing. It was. It was the chicken, the corralling the chicken, corralling chicken, corralling chicken into the small little See, uh, I'm fenced a lot in area. About myself. I'm really good at corralling chickens. She's good at corralling chickens. No, I know. Who would have known if we hadn't done that? I was thinking of all the ones that I didn't win. For and sure. It's a little depressing. Yeah. Yeah. Can be. What? Things can be depressing sometimes. That's all uh -huh. I meant to say. Are we fighting? Yeah. I think we better get that music queued up. Mama! What do you want? Are we fighting about chickens? We are fighting about chickens. Why are we fighting again about chickens? Because of the sand. Do you want to get on my hot rod bicycle of love? Are you part of a biker love gang? I'm part of the biker love gang. and we Maybe. We ride around and we go to drive-ins and see romantic comedies. Yeah, but the big problem is there's not a lot of drive-ins anymore. No, so where do you go? So we're on the bike for a long time. A trip. A really long time. Uh, I, I'm I talking days. So. I'm I, talking a long time. I don't think I want to be with you. You need to. You're the love. You're my dest. You're my density. <laughs> density or density not. I don't think I want to travel really far. Do you like? Do you like Cheetos? Maybe. I've had them for a couple of weeks in my pocket. Oh, nice and warm. That's actually a really good way to serve them. Anyway. How long is the music? Oh, I don't know. It took a minute. Oh, my gosh. It's too long. It's long. <laughs> I'm going to take out all this bone meal. Who would want some good bone? Oh, you put some bones in here, didn't you? Oh, yeah. I brought the bones back. Oh, yeah. It's, it's a bones bag. We're going to... 
them bones, them bones, gonna. Oh, yeah. We're gonna make some stacks Grow of some bones. Grow some trees. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. All right. You got your axe ready? Are we doing it right now? Well, it's 11.06, so. Oh, my gosh. We stream till about 11.30, so and we're then gonna. Are you gonna get that hokey dokey article or no? Oh, we gotta still do that. Well, let's yeah. go pick a place and I'll do the article and then we'll go into the thing. I warped. Hello, mama. Hi. Hello, mwah. Hi. Oh, I just headbutted you. Hi, um, where do we plant these trees? Headbutt, is there, headbutt and a kiss. Is there a place we want trees? Because that's always helpful. Although we're gonna chop them down. So I wouldn't know. worry. We can go into the the sheep field. The sheep field. Which direction is the sheep? Oh, I think I think I'm going the right direction. You may, but you I don't do. remember. I don't. Oh, Jackson. Oh, sheep <laughs> that I'm gonna kill. Okay, so am I not saving these eggs? Or we'll save them for another time. You can do whatever you want with those eggs. I thought we were going to do an egg competition sometime. That would be for another time. Yeah. Okay. Another time. Because this Jackson. time. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, okay. me. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. All right, so I'm heading out to the sheep field. Yeah. The lamb pasture. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, one of the so I'm going to give you so one of the tips. Oh, wait, let's do this. What are you doing? I'm gonna climb up on something so I don't get killed by something. Why are we gonna get killed? There's just skeleton people and Where? Oh, maybe in the field? I don't know. Am I heading in for banjo? Look at all this fencing, folks. Look at my fencing. I did a whole episode. Yeah, I know. I did an amazing episode where we just fenced the So this is the little cottage that we've been in and out of that I've been How do you warping get to. In? Uh, you jump over the fence. How? Look, oh uh, you jump on all the dirt and jump over the fence. Oh no, I think I installed a gate over you did. here. Yeah, I jumped over. That's for ladies. So the little cottage is called <laughs> the Competing Cottage. We, uh, we're we eventually going to try to list out all the games that we've played in our series since we've been streaming. Uh, and then we want to find out a way to have like a roulette way of the channel picking, the people in the chat picking the game we play every – and the other, the other topic we came up with, Nappy and I were talking the other day about actually having our – champion have, having our intermediate game be a different game altogether outside of minecraft too so we're playing with that idea too but oh um, my gosh so many ideas so many so ideas little so little time it's about to bed we gotta go to sleep are there beds yeah oh yeah that's real bad sleeping under the stars it's so romantic it is romantic oh my gosh what are we gonna eat for breakfast you didn't hit me when i got up i did not Oh, I, I did not. I did not. You know what happened? It, it took the damage, the fall damage happened after I woke up instead of when I jumped from here to the bed. Oh, let you rest first. That was very considerate. That was very considerate. All right, so before we do this, this uh, game, before we do this game, before it happens for the game, we want to go and do the article. So I found this article, and I thought, you people out there, if you're dating, you might need to know this. These are these are ten nonverbal signs that she likes you. Oh yeah. Now oh, things are getting hot in here. You done yet? No. <laughs> Zizi, How many different ways can you do that? <laughs> Pretty cool. Okay. So these are these are ten signs that she likes you. So I'm gonna give you a minute. Get a piece of paper and a pen, or I could just tell you the website. <laughs> <laughs> no All right, ready? And I want Mama because uh, she's a woman. I want her to verify if these if these make sense. Oh, okay. All right. It's got an important role. Sometimes re when you're on a date with a woman and although the conversation flows, you're not sure how she feels about you. Your problem is that you're an idiot and you don't just ask her. No, the problem is you're probably paying too much attention to the conversation and not listening uh -oh. to the nonverbal cues. That oh. doesn't make any sense. Communication is made up of a combination of spoken words, tone, and body language. Ew, for cues. Yeah, it's, that's why it's stupid. It should say you're not watching for or looking for. If you get caught uh, on only one part of any of those, you're only getting part of the picture. First one on the list, 
cues that she, this again the article's called cue signs that she likes you okay i don't agree with this already strong eye contact strong eye contact doesn't that mean she's just con- a considerate person that's listening to what you're talking about just because strong. a woman has strong eye contact does not mean she likes you strong is just kind of interesting Hello. that could be kind of creepy where do you work where do you work? <laughs> That's oh. what I'm picturing with strong eye Do you bring your own lunch in a bag, or do you eat it at the cafeteria every day? Okay, what's the next one? And That's again, though, I, I had someone good. from work, uh, Kiki's Delivery 5, said she's going to guess. She, she gave me three of these that she thinks she knows what they are. Did she get number one? Um, no. No, okay. Second one. I also don't agree with this. I think this is the, maybe uh-huh. you can shed light on this. Touching or playing with hair. Oh gosh. So well, I'm supposed to touch and play with your hair. No, your. You're playing or oh, twirling I play with hair. My hair. Can mean that she's feeling playful. What? And possibly nervous. Oh, girls do that all the time. And you all know the feeling of our heart beating out of our chest on a date and someone we're excited about. For some. Yeah, I don't agree, but that actually okay. is Kiki's deli- Kiki's delivery. Five says, "Plays with hair." Oh ding, 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 Good ding, job, ding, Kiki. ding, Kiki. She got one out of the three that she gave me today. All right, here we go. Number three, open posture. What does that mean? Open your body. The same goes for two. Broaden your shoulder span. Conveys confidence. And is an invitation to connect. <laughs> what? If she does this on a date, this could be a sign that she trusts you. Oh my gosh, I disagree. <laughs> I feel like these are signs for just a confident woman, and you'd want right. like a woman to be to have just confident posture and right. convey confidence. And if she has a scratch in her head, she can scratch her head without a guy going. She's being playful, and she looks a bit nervous. So if I slouch, it means I don't like you? <laughs> and that's odd because you've slouched for our entire marriage. Uh-oh, he's on to me. All right, this one. I actually – Ah, uh, uh, you like this one? No, I was trying to – so uh, Kiki said one of hers was body toward, like having your body facing the person. I don't know if that counts, that last one of open posture. Would that count? No? Okay. Yeah, number four, light touching. If her touch your arm or your leg lightly, it's a definite sign of connection. I think so. Yeah, I agree okay. with that one. So one out of... I wouldn't touch you if I didn't like you. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, I think it does. Nappy, you think, it, you think that that Kiki's counts? Oh, really? So we got open posture doesn't mean that you're facing them. I, um, I disagree. I'm the woman, so I get the final so say. No, and then yes. <laughs> so we've got one, two, three for no, and then you said light touching. Yes, okay. absolutely. Yep. Yeah, Nappy thinks that it me- hers counts, but oh, I, I guess I'd need more information. All I'm right, the fifth you. one, <laughs> which I don't agree with, smiling. See, I don't get it. That's so hokey. Well, this one may seem obvious in good conscience. I can't skip over it. A true smile is a smile that crinkles the corner of an eye. The crinkle is the way our brain recognizes the difference between a genuine smile and the smiles we pass off every day to be polite. If she's flashing you with lots of smiles, she probably feels comfortable in your company. <coughs> And there's a good chance she just likes to smile. Come on, I mean, no, it's a good chance that she likes you. This is like so. this is like a teen bop magazine. That's leading guys on. That's taking way too much hey, liberties with. I was hanging gesturing. out with a really friendly person who smiled. She likes me. Right. That's like Napoleon Dynamite weirdness. Yeah, it's kind of strange. Nope. Head tilting. That would be body posturing. Um, Head tilting is scientifically proven to make people more attractive. Women are perceived to be more attractive if they pull their heads forward and look up slightly. If her head is tilted, (laughs) it's a sign. (laughs) Or she's deaf and she can't hear you. What? Right. It's in my bad ear. What? (laughs) 
Do you think I'm pretty? What? Does that count for Kiki's? No, no. No. It still still doesn't say the same as what she was saying. Okay. Quote, unquote, number seven. Quote, unquote, accidental bumping. How is that different than light touching? Sometimes you'll find yourself on an action date. These dates are about moving around and being on the go. Action dates allow you to create memorable experiences. If you're on a romantic walk through the city, you might notice her accidentally bumping into you. I don't know if that counts. If she's a flirt and playing games kind of girl. Uh, number eight. Bl- oh, there. There's ten. Okay. There's twenty-seven. <laughs> number eight. Blushing. When we're with our crush, we get a little red in the face. I guess everybody needs. A woman gets a little blushy. Means she's probably feeling comfortable and having a good time. That could not possibly or be the wine. I'm a vessel. I want to let Maybe it she's touch embarrassed because she's thrusting her head forward and tilting her head. I think you're special. Or maybe she's embarrassed because she's playing with her hair nonstop. I think you're special. <laughs> I want to touch your leg. Maybe she's embarrassed because she falls over and bumps into you all the time. Can I poke your cheek? She's really clumsy. <laughs> all right. And then the number nine was mirroring, is when your date copies your behavior. I got no strings to hold me down. That means that she. You're not gonna copy me. Apparently, you're not mirroring me tonight. Oh. I'm really Uh, trying to listen here. Jackson Dynamite's amazing. He is amazing. Oh. Uh. So if someone mirrors you, do you agree with that, Mama? hard because these are things that I wouldn't do. <laughs> so I, I'm having trouble yeah, processing Yeah, something this. I wouldn't do either. I would be much more aware of what I was doing. And this one, the last one, which I think is like ridiculous, is uh, nostril flares. What? What? It's a biological sign of arousal? What? How are you? I don't even know. I guess we so can't. Is she intentionally flaring her nostrils to just make sure you knew that she was aroused by you? Yeah. I why well, you know what, ladies, if you're flaring your nostrils on purpose to show a guy you're into him, just tell him you think he's fun to be around and you're, you're into him. Spending way too much time overthinking this, Duh. honey. People, all these tips, ten things. It should say how to know. That she's into you, and the girl should just have one that says, "Tell a guy you're into him," and then the girl, and then the guy's article could say, "She tells you she's into you." That's what should happen. I think most of those are just all flirting stuff. Yeah. I don't know. Another fail. Under impressed. Not impressed. Okay. Under it's under impressed. Bedtime again. It's almost bedtime in real life. Well. Okay, but here, <laughs> you're it's standing almost bedtime in, real in a life. field on some gravel. You need to get to bed. There we go. Sleepy, sleepy time. Sleepy, Bed's sleepy. dynamite. Bed! <laughs> the sun has risen, and the music is for only when it sets. <laughs> I was going to say, that sounds a little weird. <laughs> <clears throat> but okay. now we're here. Where are my trees? Planting trees. How many trees do you want? How many trees do you want to do for this competition? What are we just four? To? Just four? Yeah, let's Whatever just, you're playing with. Let's just do four. Okay, those are my Couple four. Couple therapy, Minecraft edition, so I'm just gonna just apply. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. You know, you get bone meal. So you get bone meal, yep. bone meal, and bone meal. That's all oh the bone gosh. meal you get. That's a lot. Okay, yeah, it's a lot, but that's to get. 64, gar- 64, and 32? Yeah, something like that. I have a little less, but I, I that's okay. No, we can. I've got three more bones. Does that help? No, not enough. Okay. Um, so here's the plan. Here's the competition, folks. Nappy says the only one that is close to valid is the light touching one. Out of all ten of those, is that what you mean, Nappy? Out of all those ten, do you think that if you're hanging out with a girl and she, she does the light touching while you're laughing and talking and stuff, you think that's an actual cue that this person's kind of... That's kinda... a hardcore sign. Like, you're, you'd are you think, hey, I think she's into Well, me. like Mama said, if 
she didn't like you at all, she's not going to touch you. She's not going to even physically touch your arm if she's not like, hey, I, I'm having a good time with you. Well, we did that. We had a dating tip. We had a marriage tip. We talked and made fun of a website's advice on as how to usual. take, as usual, how to take cues. But now we end all of our shows as we try to wrap up by 1130-ish. We end our shows with a competition. Yes. Today's competition, uh, we try to find stuff. See, Mama Dynamite has this thing. She gets on my case about not having fair competitions because I played the game more than her. So we've had llama pushing, which I think is fair. Mm-hmm. Chicken corralling, which mm-hmm. was fair. Uh, this one, though, I think is pretty fair. We're going to basically each have to plant four trees. We have to then use bone meal to grow those trees. And then we have to chop those trees down and collect all the wood. And it doesn't matter how much wood we get from those trees. All that matters is that we plant them, grow them, chop them down. And the first one back to the platform after having done that uh, gets the prize of being the, the winner. Okay, how many bone meal do you have? Let's make it even. I have 64 plus another stack of 52. Why do I have 64, 64, and 32? I don't know. I gave you a lot of bone meal. I th- maybe I misread the number. I'm okay. not perfect. No, no, no. I'm just saying I don't want to have this be a, a thing. It's not, I have 64, 64 now. Okay, me too. Okay, let's do that. And then. four trees. Okay. All right, well, hold on. I got an extra stack. So, so with no one watching, I'm going to take the stack of 20. I'm just going to throw it. Put it in the chest. No, right no, over we don't there, need it. So, my advice to you then, so I'm going to go over here, is clear the grass. Clear the grass. Yeah, clear the grass. Wait, you're doing this now? It's yeah. not part of the No, yeah, it's not part of the game. There's going to be no timer. We can play our surf music, though. <laughs> okay, so there's no timer? No, because it's just going to be when you get the uh, trees chopped down. So, okay. it's not going to be like two minutes is up. What have you? Well, how far did you get? It's just going to be. Plant four trees, grow four trees, okay. chop down four trees. And you just right-click on them with the bone meal? I've never planted Yeah, you uh, right-click on them. Okay. Okay? And then uh, I clear all the, all the grass around you in a circle or whatever you want to do. Mm-hmm. Get out of here. Get out of my way, sheep. All right, let me cue up the music here. Ready? One, two, three. Yeah, you can't hear that though. No, it's because it's not on the it's, it's not on the tab. Tell me when we're gonna start. It's already. All right, everybody, everybody ready? Four trees, make them grow, chop them down, get back to the platform. Are you ready? Go. Just the wood. You don't have to climb the tree or get all the grass down. Oh, you gotta be kidding me with this big tree. Yeah, just get the logs. You don't have to get the. We're gonna, maybe we should we should wash. What's up? Coming back? I can't uh, run as fast as you. I always forget what button to push to go faster. Oh, man. So how many did you get? I know it wasn't about that. I'm just curious. Uh, let's see here. Chest. First chest. I have 25. I have 21. Oh. Your trees grew a teeny bit taller. Let's see how we did with getting all our pieces of wood. What do you mean? Did we didn't leave wood down? Yeah, yours totally grew taller. Did you have more space between yours? Yeah, probably. Okay. So that's how you do it? You just have more spacing? To get them taller? Yeah. Yeah, like a wolf. They, yeah, if they're too close, then if the second one grows, it's going to be overshadowed by the, I think, the leaves of the other tree. Gotcha. Bah, 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 you bah, bah, again, Jackson. Oh. I'll get you next time, my pretty. My what? <laughs> what? I'll get you next I'll time. I'll get my you pretty. next time, my pretty. Okay. We got bone meal. Put bone meal in here. Tree saplings. Sit that in there. I got. Yeah. What makes sense to leave in these chests? I don't know. 
I can always do this, revisit this game again. And I gotta oh, get yay. <laughs> <laughs> up the ante. So excited. Uh, do we have, uh, is there wheat in any of these chests? Three, what do you need? You have what? Three. Oh, I was gonna just need some of these sheep I while know, we're here. I know, I only have three. I can get some. <coughs> we should come back here and build an actual cottage to... Or a barn or something, or? There's no, just something for the... Something wrong with that door? <laughs> no, I was uh, looking yet. Just, just looks like something wrong with it. Well then, folks, that about wraps it up. We did the dating tip. Oh, chicken! Oh, you killed the chicken! We killed the chicken. Hold on, maybe maybe we'll get a chicken egg. No. Dead, dead, dead. Dead chicken. <coughs> dating tip. We did the marriage tip. We talked about seven cues to know that she is into you. Maybe. Maybe. If she doing that, and then. Uh, Kiki's livery five uh, only got one of them, so uh, and we just did our competition. And I comp won again. And our competition, and I won again. But not that we're counting; we're keeping track. But just so we don't forget, let me put a thing up on our chalkboard here. And I just get out on the chalkboard. Jackson, however many we've done, Mama, one. One. It's okay. Cause we, I won. we could do that, but we're not going to do that on this episode. <laughs> now, but everybody in the chat, thank you so much. If you're new to the channel, we'd love to follow. Please click the follow button so you can tune in next time. I'm going to try to stream Tuesday. Um, I do have a pact with myself that I only stream Tuesdays and Fridays just because we have a big family. I think it's 14 kids now. I think one came down in the break. Um, so with the, having the kids and the married life and all that good stuff, we try to obviously prioritize our lives, right? Right. We try. We try. So with that said, uh, one of the things I was going to say, though, is I, uh, I, I'm trying to get more involved in doing my voiceover work on the side. So I have this goal that I'm not streaming on Tuesdays if I don't get enough done in my real life towards doing voiceover work. So right now um, – my goal between now and Tuesday is I have a, a microphone that I'm borrowing that I'm testing in this room that I've treated with some sound paneling, and I'm trying to get it to sound uh, super great so I can do voiceovers from the house. So we will see how that goes. And uh, if all goes well, Tuesday I'll be on, and it's just a show I do where we talk about stoicism and we talk about being a person of doom, getting stuff done in your life to not be a procrastinator and live in mediocrity. But we play Minecraft. And then Couples Therapy will be back next Friday, unless something crazy happens. I hope not. <laughs> yeah, we don't want crazy crazy stuff to I happen. Don't want crazy. But anyway, nope, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. If you're still there, click follow. If you got Amazon Prime, make sure you link it with your Twitch account, and we'd love the subprime Twitch subscription. Or if you just got a boatload of cash, we could use about four grand a month maybe oh yeah and then i'll just we'll stream more often but until next time we love you goodbye keep it real follow us on twitter here and youtube if you want ta-ta